Peace be upon you, friends. Today on Speaking History, we're diving into the life of a Roman emperor who pulled off feats no other Roman ruler could. Despite his tough demeanor, history has a lot to say about him. We're talking about Julius Caesar and his incredible achievements that still have the world in awe. In the heart of Rome, during a time of unparalleled chaos and political turbulence, a figure was born who would reshape the destiny of an empire. Julius Caesar, born in 100 BCE, emerged in an era where Rome was grappling with the aftermath of its decisive victory over Carthage in the Second Punic War. This triumph had vastly increased Roman wealth but had also sown seeds of social and economic disruption. By the 2nd century BCE, Rome had evolved from a modest city-state governed by a council of wise men into a sprawling empire plagued by mismanagement. Political corruption and bribery were rampant, and the Mediterranean region groaned under Roman oppression. Rome itself was a cauldron of chaos, with power struggles and civil strife shaking the city from within. Amidst this turmoil, Julius Caesar stood out as a beacon of clarity and ambition, recognizing the futility of the existing democratic government. Hailing from an aristocratic family, Caesar received a stellar education and quickly entered the political arena. By 58 BCE, at just 42 years old, he was appointed governor of three critical provinces, Cisalpine Gaul, Illyricum, and Narbonensis Gaul. Commanding four Roman legions, he embarked on a series of military campaigns that would cement his place in history. From 58 to 51 BCE, Caesar and his legions waged relentless campaigns across Gaul, an area encompassing modern-day France, Belgium, parts of the Netherlands, Germany, and Switzerland. Despite being outnumbered, his tactical genius led to the defeat of numerous barbarian tribes, expanding Rome's dominion to the Rhine River. Caesar even launched an audacious expedition to Britain, though it yielded no lasting victories. Caesar's conquests in Gaul transformed him from a prominent political figure into a legendary hero. His unparalleled success and popularity unnerved his political adversaries in Rome. When his military duties concluded, the Roman Senate ordered him to return to Rome as a private citizen, effectively stripping him of his power. Foreseeing the dangers posed by his enemies, Caesar made a fateful decision that would alter the course of history. On the night of January 10 to 11, 49 BCE, defying explicit Senate orders, Caesar crossed the Rubicon River with his army and marched towards Rome. This audacious move ignited a civil war, signaling the end of the Roman Republic and the dawn of a new era. The conquest of Gaul had far-reaching implications. It fortified Rome's northern frontiers and influenced the evolution of the French language, derived in part from the Latin spoken by Caesar's troops. The question lingers, would Rome have conquered Gaul without Caesar? The fragmented Gallic tribes and Rome's burgeoning military prowess suggest that Caesar's unique combination of strategy and leadership was crucial in this monumental achievement. In retrospect, Caesar's indomitable will and military brilliance not only expanded Rome's borders but also set the stage for the transformation of the Roman Empire. His legacy as the conqueror of Gaul and the architect of Rome's imperial destiny remains etched in the annals of history, a testament to a man who dared to defy the odds and reshape the world. If you enjoy this informative video, don't forget to like and share it. Also, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon, and drop your feedback in the comments. See you in the next video. Goodbye.